All right. Everything charred goes. I don't care if it's on the walls, on the floor, if it's my espresso maker, it goes. Get your chisels, your scrapers, and your demo bars, and Mateo, here you go. Whoa, 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 no fair. Why does he get the sledgehammer? Because I called it on the ride over. Today's my shoulder day. Yeah, right, Proby. It has nothing to do with Thor. Also Thor. Also not Proby. Not anymore. When we opened this firehouse, you were looking at firefighter Mateo Chavez. Hey! Hey! Seriously? Oh, yeah. The squad insisted. How my favorite goddaughter's doing, huh? We're doing good. Ah! Well, okay then. Miss Tony, this is me you change your mind? The other girls wouldn't have it any other way. I have no idea how we're gonna make this work, but. These are my people. This is home. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Like the boys pulled through. They sure did. Hey, what do you say, Billy? I thought you had uh, that meeting or whatever. Yeah, we finished early. Good. Well, welcome to the party. You're a little overdressed there, Cap. Well, as it turns out, I'm not gonna be a captain for much longer. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't tell me they shut down your firehouse. Not exactly. Uh, Hey, everyone, can you hold the work for a second? Come on over. I, I got something I need to say. I uh, wanted you all to be the first to hear this direct from me. As soon as Deputy Chief Radford's retirement is official, I'm going to be Austin's new Deputy Chief. Hey, that's amazing. Congratulations, Bill. Yeah. Thank you. I think everybody here knows that I consider this firehouse to be sacred ground. I want y'all to know, each and every one of you, you have lived up to the great legacy of these fine men. That's about the highest compliment I could ever pay you, which makes this next part so hard. There's no reason to continue what you're doing here today. We're shutting down the 126 permanently. This department is headed for a financial crisis. I just read a very persuasive report that says there's gonna be dire consequences. We don't start making the hard choices. I wrote that report. Yes, you did. Wait, so we're never getting back together? I understand this is a painful sacrifice, but it is for the greater good. But you're not deputy chief yet, are you? No, not yet. Good.